this going here. Check, check. Okay, can you see me? Great, okay. So for this week's video blog, I wanted to focus on patient experience. So I've asked Mary Jane McNally, our Chief Patient Experience Officer, and uh, Melissa Corbett, one of our physiotherapists, to help me just uh, talk a little bit about what does patient experience really mean. Uh, you know, we, we've identified that patient experience means a lot more than just the quality of the clinical services that we provide for patients. We know that it's got something to do with the way that we make patients feel, uh, the way that we greet them, the way that we uh, that we connect with them as people. Uh, I thought this week that we would just try to explore that a little bit and from look at it from the perspective of one of our care providers. So I'm just gonna bring Mary Jane and Melissa into the into the picture. So um, Melissa, if I can, let me start with you. Sure. Um, uh, from your point of view, what uh, as a practitioner, what does patient experience mean to you? Can I take that for you? Sure. Um, so I think you actually took the words out of my mouth when you said it's about how patients feel. Do they feel they were valued as a member of their care team? Do they feel like their opinion mattered to their care providers? Um, do they feel like they were respected? And did they feel safe? So did right. they feel like they were getting the right care from the right people? Um, yeah, those sorts of things. I don't know if you have anything else to add to that. But. What, I, what I think is really important is that combination of effectiveness, efficiency in care delivery, um, really um, making sure that we're doing the right thing at the right time, um, and being um, efficient with that, as well as building in the empathy, the compassion, mm -hmm. and the care. So engaged staff means engaged patients and families and a really satisfied and meaningful experience. Uh, Mary Jane, you mentioned that we measure things mm -hmm. in this process as an organization. Can you just tell me a little bit about what we do with that information? really important that we share the voice of the patient and family with the organization. And I know as frontline staff it certainly helps to have that feedback come back to know that you're you're doing a good job and the patients feel good when they leave the hospital. You know, do you think about the uh, patient experience? Like is it something that you, you reflect on or how do you work it into your day-to-day -day practice? Um, so I know one of the biggest things is I always kind of look at the patient as though they were a family member and how I'd want my family member to be treated. I know that's kind of a very important thing to me. Um, I want them to feel like they're valued and that they know what's going on. They have an idea of what our plan is for the day. Well, that's fantastic. So thank you very much for sharing that with us. Let's keep the conversation going about patient experience. And you know, we do great work here every day. We provide excellent experience for our patients. Let's just keep it top of mind and let's do our very best to kind of do the best that we can for our patients every day. Thank you.